All right, World of Outlaw time. We are at Williams Grove. And uh, amazingly qualified seventh overall. So fairly good for me. Just going to see what we can get here. Top seven transfer. It's a massive heat race. We got 25 cars in the split. It's a single split. So uh, seven transfer from each heat and then four from the B main. And there's going to be quite a few cars going home. Hopefully I'm not one of them. Uh, track is going to get extremely dry slick. And usually I like that. But we're at Williams Grove and I am terrible here. And the drier it gets, the worse I get. So, at least that's how it felt in practice. Um, who knows? One to go. Next I am the line. number eight car, so might not be a whole lot of speed in the bottom half of the field. But if we can get a top ten in the main, I'll be happy. This heat race is just about surviving and getting to the A main because... I don't want to end up in the B main. There will be uh, quite a few cars in that and only four transferring, so a lot easier to transfer from the heat than the B. The pace car is in, pace car is off. Green, green, green. All right, decent start. We're going to avoid the top out of four. Well, I wanted to avoid the dry slick, but... Oh, they're all dying behind. That makes my job a little easier. So, Williams Grove being Williams Grove, it's obviously going to spread out pretty deep. Top side right now is not the quickest way to go. I'm just avoiding doing anything stupid on the bottom. Although I might do something stupid on the top, you never know. Guy behind is a little quicker, but it's a difficult track to get a pass done. He might be able to do it. I hope we're getting the white. Alright. And we're going to finish fourth. So, Brandon gave us a hell of a time. He'll be quicker in the main. He looked like he got a lot better handle on his car. So, we'll be starting seventh in the main, though. And now we get to watch two races. Just go back and watch our heat race. Go ahead and put ourselves in the stands. Make sure this is the only camera. Get us a decent zoom. I look like a... 
terrible nut job out there on the start on the outside of four, swaying all around. Eleven. I don't know if he got the tire or what, and then they all collect each other behind. Sixteen. Unfortunately, was mid pack, and he's gonna probably go back to the B main. Just running through the slick spot right there, like a complete idiot. Let's see the 11's line into here. Yeah, he was being smart, keeping it low off the corner. I just gave up on that. Figured if you can't pass me. Might as well just keep running the high side. He almost got me there. But I'm probably scaring the hell out of him with my little squigs down the uh, straightaway there. Juke left and right. I don't know what the fuck a squig is. Brain stopped working there. Decent race, though. He was quicker. Just, uh... Couldn't get it done. Bogged down a bit there in the middle of the corner. He had the nose on me there. But couldn't get it hooked up on the up, on the inside there. So let's go check out this race. Everyone's paint schemes loading in. most of these names in this race. And before I get my setups, dry slick, because it's going to get slick. Alright, so transfer spot is right here. Top 7 transfer, 12 car looking to get in right now, but Looks like he's got that wing way back already. Oh, that might have just changed the transfer spot. Seen one stopped on the back stretch. Oh. Nope, still battle for transfer spot here. 12 in the 15. 15's going to throw it low, but he stops a bit too hard, then hits the slick. We got a slow car. The 7, who is now in the transfer spot, so that puts the 12 up into too good. And the 22 is going for, going for the spot. Don't know if there was a little netco contact there, or the 7 just is broke from whatever happened to him. So now 15 and the 22 battling for spots. 15's just been one outside of the transfer spot this entire time. He's getting the bottom side hooked up now out of four, though. He's going to go low. Can he keep it hooked up? He gets two sideways. I think he'd lift off the gas too much. He's got the wiggles. All right, seven car. He's trying to make it back up there, and he won't because the race is over. So the 22 transfers in. Now we are in 11 car B main. That is why I did not want to be in this race. But I think a few are leaving. Yes, three have already left for some unknown reason. I don't think people understand how the heat and main format works. So 
So 14 should, well, 16 and 14, I think, should get in. I don't know if 13 was in that issue. 7 should. We'll see if the 15 just hangs out in 5th again, one spot out of transfer, or what happens to him. So, 10 cars, 4 spots, or no, that's 8 cars. Learn to count, moron. Eight cars, four spots, half the field is going away after this. So they're doing 10 laps, no cautions. Track's really not as slick as I thought it would be by now. Um, obviously in the main, it's going to go pretty quick, 30 laps, 18 cars, hopefully most of it under green. Cautions still are counting in this series for who knows what reason. Here they go. Green, green, green. Seven's going to go to the top, 13 loses a bit of speed through the middle there but he's going to come back on the 15 and right now the 15 is in the final transfer spot 19 gets a little loose off the corner and there goes the 15 into the wall contact with the 20 his chances are over so top three are pulled away 16 is going to be looking to get up to that 20 uh, the 14 not going to transfer. Not pitching it that sideways in the corner. Not going to be going forward. So, 20 car. Let's uh, zoom out a bit. He's actually tracking down the 13. 16's tracking him down, though, and it's all going to come together. Three cars battling for two spots. Twenty gets it hooked up on the bottom, up into third. Here comes the sixteen. He's gonna slide up to the middle, almost contact. Everyone behind looking like they don't have a shot to catch this unless there's a contact. So thirteen's gonna jump to the bottom, try to get that grip. The twenties. 20s going uh, left to right down the straightaway. And that's not going to work. 16's in. 20's gone. And the 14 is going to make it. Unless he screws up. Looks like he's got a little better handle on his car now. Rolling the bottom. He's in that transfer spot. Pulling away from the 17, it looks like. Yeah, 17. No grip. He's trying to uh, throttle it a bit hard there. 14's got the handle on it, and we're coming down to the white flag. Up front, 19's walking away with this one. Seven's just hanging out behind him. And 
we've got the four cars that are going to be joining us, although seven's trying, but not going to get there. Fourteen's going to come around and get that final transfer spot for 30 laps. Cautions are on now. Let's hope we don't need to use them. Luckily, we're Fly starting 7th out of 18, down. and hopefully I can stay in this half of the field. Alrighty. A main. So, definitely first lap, going to try to roll the bottom. And then uh, hopefully everything gets all sorted out. Biggest issue is going to be outside line coming down out of four. Just because it is so slick there and it's a massive, uh, massive little bump that starts to form too that will send you to the left. So. Just looking for a top 10. If we can get more, awesome. Next time, bye. Just gotta remember that this thing's got lots of power on the initial start. Not do my normal slam the throttle down about to go green stay focused all right here we go pace car is off pace car is off green 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 slid up a little too much luckily i had the room to do so didn't kill anyone Too much. Go high, outside. Clear up top. Again, seven, too much. Five, Couldn't get five. it down. You're in fifth. Inside. Clear. Outside. Clear high. Outside. Still there. Clear high. Nineteen point two two. Too much eight. again. Need to get a better handle on it. Ease it through the center of the corner. Alright, you can't just come down when we're three wide, bud. No, it's that dipshit. Now it makes sense. He doesn't give a fuck about anyone else on the track. Had I known that was the car. I would have known that was going to happen. We're three wide. Let's just survive.
All right, so I'm in ninth. Gonna fall back to tenth in a second. All right. Well, gone backwards, but uh, we'll recover. I was not doing a good entry on the bottom, and then I was sliding up into the slick stuff. Bottom's almost gone now too, so I think it's nearly time to just throw that wing all the way back and uh, roll through the slick and then gun it once we get to the moisture. One and two isn't as bad. Three and four is pretty wide right now. B main 16 has passed us. But yeah, I had to back out there. Three wide in the middle just not worth it to wreck on lap seven. Get a little handle on the car. Hopefully don't lose too many spots, but you never know. Like I said, I was expecting to go backwards once it got slick. One to go, next time by. So definitely think middle and outside in one and two now, after looking at the track. And then try to roll the bottom the best I can in three and four. Luckily we got a halfway decent run in there. Hopefully that continues. Pace car is off. Pace car is off. Green, green, green. Net code, not actually a person crashing. Everyone trying to get the grip down the uh, front stretch on the bottom. All right, so back up to ninth. Don't know if we'll be able to hold on to it, but got one car flying on the outside. Seven cars hauling ass. Still there, 19.511, clear. The yellow flag is out. They want you in single file. Close. And luckily we get the spot over him. Oh look, the dipshit has found himself back here after running into the wall multiple times. Pit road is now open.
can't even fucking pace. Alright, well, still looking like 10th. Uh, 11 car fell off massively that run. And, uh, yeah, 7's got the top hooked. Nothing I can do about that. So, we're just gonna run through the slick and get it hooked up when we can. Definitely need to get a better start than I did last time. I uh, thought there was going to be an accordion effect, and they had went way early. So we're going to be nine to go when we go green. Hopefully we can just One left to green. finish it off here with green run. 50.925, 10 to go, this time by. About to go green, stay focused. The pace car is off, be ready. The pace car is off, be ready. Green flag, green flag. 40.896. Whew! Barely survived that. See if there's anything up here. Nope. Got on it too hard too soon. Fucking come on, people. Alright, well, seven car disappeared. And ten car finally screwed up enough that we got back past him. Or past him. Don't know if we were ever past him. Sitting in eighth where we should be. You got five laps to go. Pit road's open. Just a tiny bit of grip randomly throughout the top. Not all the way up by the wall. Up by the wall you can still haul up there and then same thing in one and two just a little longer bits of grip about three quarters of the way up One left to green. Alright, so quick little shootout to end this one. Hopefully you'll stay eighth. Gain a spot, hopefully too, but 
Uh, 16's quicker, so I don't think we have a chance at that. Only chance we got is the two car wrecking someone or himself. Get ready, going green. The pace car is off, be ready. Pace car is off. Green flag, green flag. All right, uh, there's one spot. Unfortunately, an X, but another spot. And what, we come out sixth here? <laughs> well, that was lucky. There's the flag. It's over. Yep, so sixth place, Great I'll job. take that. Really well. I'm pretty sure that the 16 ate the uh, wall there before the bridge. And not sure what happened on the other one. But I'll take it. Let's go watch that back. Get zoomed in a bit here. Luckily, everyone went way up top because I totally missed the bottom there. And then, yeah, that was a shit entry. Right sides in the slick. in the slick so being really terrible at this point then dipshit runs into me as expected and he tries to take me out as expected the guy's just fucking clueless Luckily, he finally pulls his head out of his ass and pulls away. So we were ahead of the 10 after his first screw up. Three wide, dipshit comes down. And just going backwards at this point, all over the place right now. Could not get it hooked up, kind of forgot about the wing. Said, nope, don't need to do that. Stay alive. Four there, 16's coming into play now. He gets it hooked up on the bottom. And I think this is caution. Yep. All right, so terrible restart. Look at him go as I just sit there. So I don't know what happened to the 11. He just went backwards. Maybe that contact screwed him up. I 
I just said screw it at this point, started running middle and just driving through the slick because I was not being good enough to find the moisture. Power down around the 11, but overdrove entry. Luckily got the power down. He was struggling. And then the seven just comes hauling ass. Like, look at this guy. He had it hooked right up along the wall. Gaining a ton through three and four with that. And I'm just staying away from every wall on both sides. And way too sideways there. Seven's just going to rip it around the outside here. And then we pass him in the center, and yellow comes out. So I get the spot back. So another terrible start. Not as bad, though. What the hell happened to the seven? Ten car losing it there. We get past him. Is that where the seven got in trouble? No, he's still digging. He had to lift off. Eleven got past him. Still got the top hooked. There he goes. Ate the wall on entry. That's what the yellow was, and that's why he disappeared. And then the final shootout, where a bunch of shit happened. Actually hit the strip I was aiming for for once. a decent drive off of four because the bottom just moisture has gone. 16 came up after seeing me on that last lap so we go to the bottom and he goes into the wall and luckily we didn't get a chunk of that. Then what happened up here? Four and the five make a bit of contact. Five goes into the wall, and we get another freebie. Finish sixth. So, um, tough race. I mean, there was uh, quite a few fast guys in front of me, and some of those guys, like the 16, that dude was quick. Even though he had to go to the B, that was because of a wreck, so... Let's take a quick look at the results. And we gained 36 I rating. Safety rating doesn't change. But not too terrible. 2,500 strength of field. It's not bad. So good race overall. Just wish it would have been cautions not counting. Get us a few more laps. Get the track a little slicker. Maybe a few more mistakes out of people. But yeah. That was a full field of outlaws at Williams Grove, and I survived. 
even though I was kind of trash right at the start. So, hope you enjoyed that. Thanks for watching.